Hey guys, welcome to Talking Fowl. On this episode, we'll be hunting down in South Texas, finishing up our teal season with my dad and my wife. I hope y'all enjoy. <laughs> So my hunting week started off on a Thursday with my grandfather. It was super slow. We had a few storm systems moving in. I think that kind of pushed the ducks up north a little bit. So we really didn't have any action Thursday morning. I mean, it was very slow, very non-active. Uh, so I really didn't get much footage that day. Friday, I went with a buddy, Kevin. It's kind of the same situation. We had a few storms moving through the area, super slow not really any action at all. We had one little teal come in right, right at daybreak and he was working a little bit but never did come in. And uh, that was pretty much my Thursday and Friday. Super slow, not really much action. So we left uh, Saturday, it was me, my dad, and my wife. We all went down and we were gonna try it again Saturday, hoping our luck would change. And uh, Saturday came along, still really slow but we did have action right at daybreak, right around seven o'clock. I mean, it really started to get active. Got a few birds out of that group. As I was leaving to go get some of the ducks, we had a few missed opportunities. Uh, we had a few groups come in that we didn't really quite see come up on us and we missed some birds out of that group. Had a few more groups come in. I think we got maybe another duck or so. And uh, really after about 8.30, same thing, super quiet, not really much activity. So we uh, we bailed out probably about 9.30 and we're back home by 11. Sunday we were hunting a, a J-hook spread and uh, we had most of our decoys to the, to the right of us and then a small little line coming in front of us and off to the left with three mojos. And uh, we had three ducks come in right at daybreak. I mean, they came in perfect, textbook. We smoked those ducks, and really after that, that's about all we saw. Uh, we did have one little teal come over right as my dad went to go fix one of the mojos that has had kind of like a gangster lean to it. So uh, as soon as he fixed it right, teal came swooping right over his head, and I didn't really get to get the shot at it. I didn't really want to take that shot. So uh, that one got away also. Total for our teal season, I think we got maybe 24, 25 ducks the whole season. I mean, it's not great, but you know, we weren't smacking them, but we were on them. So for me, that's a good season. So, so really what I want to do with this channel is what you see right now. I mean, hunting, filming our hunting. Uh, another part is me making the duck calls. You can see how they're made. Uh, if you know, if you're a guy at home that wants to get into the same thing. That's kind of what I want to do with that. Also want to do October, from October all the way to, to big duck season, I want to train my dog boss. You'll see some of that, some of that self-training. Um, and we'll see how it works. I mean, it could either go really good or it could go really bad. He knows some of his obedience right now. He can retrieve. And uh, we just need to put it all together and, and he'll be a pretty good duck dog. Um, but that's my goal for the channel. Uh, that's really why I created this, is film the hunting, make the duck calls, and train the dog. I mean, that's really, that's really what this channel is gonna be about. But uh, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope to have better footage come big duck season, maybe more cameras. But uh, I thank you all for watching, and please like and subscribe, and come back for more. Thank you all.